we could find a way to open Rome travel to Sparta Farm, I bet there'd be all sorts of useful equipment for us. Enough. To... We will go. Really? But if we do not find Tyr, you will abandon your search for good. All right. You won't be sorry. Hmm? and breed is that atreus it's been so long <gasps> how you've grown <laughs> uh oh uh, yeah <sighs> well if you'll follow me brock mentioned he needed somewhere safe to spend the night and i believe your favorite dwarves can help you out with that we're still your favorite dwarves right you're still the only dwarves we know i'll take it after you my friends Where are we going? The cleanest cabin in all the Nine Realms. And I'd prefer it to stay that way. Not looking at anyone in particular. Kratos. <clears throat> After that Thor incident, we thought we should make up some rooms. Till you can figure out your next moves. Nearly there. As you can see, we've settled here in the Realm Between Realms. It's nothing much, but it's safe from Fimblewinter, safe from Odin's eyes. And you really can't beat the view if you're into shimmering gray voids. That's amazing, Sin. We have a plan to talk to you about, actually. Intriguing. Come in. Come in! Now, if you would just wipe your feet very thoroughly, I'll wait. You're not gonna wipe your feet, are you? Okay then, your bedrooms are there, the kitchen is just over there. Any, anybody need a snack? Kratos, snack? I do not need a snack. What we need is your help getting to Sparto Farm so we can try and rescue Tyr. To Tyr? Al alive? I mean, that's, <laughs> what? It it's okay, I told him everything. Everything? You waited my son in disobeying me. No, I, I kept an eye on him. On your behalf. Nothing risky. Everything very safe. Somebody else speak. What's important right now is that we try and open up travel between realms again. Oh. You said you know a way? Yes, I do. I just... It's just... There's... It's just a lot of mud. Then why haven't you opened the way already, man? Well, to be frank, there was... Something we needed your help with. Oh, the Holder brothers finally require the services of the smartest man alive. That's it precisely. Hey! Not so fast. How'd that get in here? What the hell is he anyway? That is my son. Well, what in all yarns me the happen to him? He's too damn tall now. Looks like that. I blame you. Well, come on then. Let's get him something that fits at least. He's just getting older, you dark prat. Didn't you ever have an awkward phase in your youth? Hey. Yeah, I suppose what's done is done. But you'll be putting your foot down from now on if you know what's good. Oh, he's trying. Believe me. All right, let's gear you fuckers up before you go off gallivant. Begin with this. Mmm. Busted up good. Hm. Wouldn't you rather I just whip you up a new one? It is important to me. Well, I'll see what I can do. In the meanwhile, how about I fix you up with something to get you by? I only 
got materials to make one of these in the here and now. You bring me more resources, we'll see what we can do. If the kid's gonna insist on getting taller, best make a habit of swinging in for new duds. Hmm. Looks like Fimble Winner's been hard on our girl. Give her here. She's overdue for some rock love. Some items you left behind, tossed them in the chest. What would you do without me? I'm gonna go look around, check out my room. Tell Sindri when you're ready. I knew he'd left something behind. This place is great, Sindri. You built it all yourself? You know it. See? I knew you wanted a snack. Hey, come see. I guess this is where they store the food. Nice to have options if I wake up hungry.
Finding everything all right, I hope? How do we unlock the realms? We'll just need something from back at the workshop. Follow me, and be sure to bring the head. <laughs> so, where exactly is Tyr being held? He's imprisoned in a mine somewhere. That's all we know so far. Hmm. The realm is full of mines, you realize. You'll need help narrowing it down. Oh, you should talk to Durlin. Who's Durlin? He's a cousin of ours, sort of. Works for the city on safety issues. Should have access to all kinds of information on mines. And I know he's no friend of Odin. That's why your mother sought his help when she was trying to whip up a rebellion. Ready? A rebellion? Did you know about that? I did not. A rebel leader who knew mom. Sounds like exactly what we need. I think you missed the ta-da. Well, never mind. I'll have this oiled up in no time. Meet you at the gateway outside. Rebel leader? Derlin? <laughs> if that ain't giving a hound a haircut. Huh? And you, you just remember things however they pop into your being, don't you? I suppose you think Derlin's just counting the days until a couple of strays show up looking for trouble. What do you mean, Brock? Will he help us or not? No, oh, never mind. It ain't old Brock's place to cast asparagations on my relations. This smudge sponger notwithstanding. Ignoring you. Fine. Go darken Derlin's door. See for yourself how it goes. Just be warned, he's not the friendly sort of dwarf folk you're used to. He's cranky as all get out. And he talk funny, too. Sounds like a true study in contrast. You hear that? Are those some kind of dragons? They're so far, I can't tell how big they are. We just need the Bifrost in the head. Brock? Do the touching. Oh, this would be the part requiring my assistance, then. You said it. This device here has been crafted to your measurements. It'll help you get a better look at the problem with those Bifrost eyes of yours. So, I uh, do I control this thing somehow, then? Oh, no, 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 no. This is just to hold you in place while we shine this light in your eyes. Oh, oh, Cindy, a studding bastard! <laughs> Open. Open now. I was really hoping not to use the eyelid clamps. Do it. <laughs> oh! That's it. That's it. Good. Now, release. Still unpleasant. Oh, that's our cue. Come on, hurry! I'm coming, I'm coming! Rassel does eggs, man! What was that for? You'll see soon enough. Just... There! That should do it! See? No permanent damage. I'll show you permanent damage, you wee fuck! Gritos! Throw me at him! Horns first! <laughs> Guess you takes a joke, you old goat! <laughs> Bifrost is broken. Now that we've reconfigured these gateways to use Yggdrasil seeds, you won't need a travel table or a Bifrost lamp anymore. I also used it for light. Okay, good note. I'll figure something out, but first... Come on, let me show you how it works. Aim your key at the rune for Svartalfheim on the right, then concentrate.
This should take you to the wetlands outside Nidavalir City. Just make your way to the town square and ask for Durlin at the tavern. You sure they'll know him at the tavern? Durlin's always been an inveterate inebriate. I suppose he might have completely changed, but in my experience, eh. Did you want to come with us? Oh, I might drop in, but the wetlands are moist. And the Grim are everywhere. Hostile, slimy, foul-smelling creatures. But good luck! Thanks. Wait, what? I said good luck! Whoa! Do you feel that? What's that, lad? Anything. E everything. It's warm. probably use this boat if I can just get it free. Careful, lad. Why are these things so bad? already off to a lively stop. Petraeus, you dropped your guard. I got the boat free, though. We can head through these channels when you're ready. What's the chain in the water for? That'd be a dwarven supply ferry. Said ferry appears to be missing. Huh. I still can't believe Mom led a whole rebellion here, against Odin, and never talked about it. The fact that it didn't go well might have helped that notion. What your mother did before we met was her business. Did you ever ask? Eyes on the water. They are resources. If you never asked Mom about what she used to do, what did you talk about when you met? Like, did you just say... Woman, guard the house. I will go to catch fish in the river. And then leave for five days? No. Your mother was far better at fishing than I did. Did you see that over there? <laughs> that wheel is blocking the channel. 
I imagine if you can turn it, we should be able to get through. So these are wetlands, huh? Pretty accurate. It is a bog. The smell is making my eyes burn. You know, it is a fair bit more potent than when I last visited, now that you mention it. <laughs> Looks like the path continues on the other side of that geyser. <laughs> if only we were in Midgard. That water'd be frozen in a second. <laughs> <laughs> Tyr was a friend to the Giants. I wonder if he and Mom ever met. If he was a part of the Rebellion here. It's certainly possible. The God of War often advocated for the Giants. Although I don't recall if he ever declared allegiance outright. Come on. There's gotta be a faster way to get down there. Oh! <laughs> 
Okay, there's gotta be some way to turn the wheel up here. Well there! Never mind some warning if he's about to suddenly end up snout deep in cheek. The ground. Was that an earthquake? Hmm. An occasional but not unheard of happenstance in Svartalfheim. With all the mining here, the land's bound to be a wee bit bothered. Oh, wow. Nice job getting it to lower exactly where we need it. I was thinking, because it's so warm, maybe it's not that the cold hasn't made it here yet, but maybe it's just different in Svartalfheim? I lie. Thimble Winter doesn't strike all realms quite the same way. Weird that Thimble Winter doesn't always make it winter. In Midgard it does, but as you can see, the effects here appear far more gaseous in nature. Observe the geysers. Observe the aforementioned aroma. These effects were present before in some form, but now there's new extremity to them. Think we can fit under that bridge? Father, up there. <clears throat>
Find anything good up there? everywhere. Did they cap those geysers? <clears throat> hmm. I think we need to get that wheel moving, but the water doesn't reach. one of those geysers. Is there another one somewhere? Imagine them siding with Odin. Well, all too often people are blinded to all but their immediate self-interest. Odin offered them safety, and defying him can be quite dangerous. Maybe they just need a couple of gods to come along and take the fight to him. Atreus, that is not why we are here. I was only joking. War is not a joke, especially where gods are concerned. Yikes. This place is wrecked. And yes, I am staying alert. There are probably tons of those Grim around. Yeah. <laughs> 
Atreus, you intend to recruit Tyr as an ally for war. I just... I'm trying to keep our options open. Let's just keep moving. I'm glad we're out here, exploring a new realm. Maybe we could just try to enjoy the warmth? Looks like we gotta find a way to open that gate if we want to get to Nidavolir. Brother, look! That stream's oh. bugger popped back out of the ground again! It's too fast. Then how shall we catch it? Flank it. Attack from behind. Good. <laughs> you did it! Let's see what it draw. Right there. There's got to be another chain to lower the rest of the gate. <laughs> Whoa! Look, there's a chain we can pull up there. <laughs> You can uncover that geyser from here. Hmm. Oh, I think I get it. If you freeze the geyser, the pressure will turn the wheel. that block <laughs> what about freezing the guys are under the wheel maybe that's one of Cavassier's poems very highbrow 
You should collect any others you find. <laughs> are you hoping to learn from Tia? Well, like I said, I was hoping he could tell me something about Loki. I'd also like to hear some of his stories. Traveling to other lands, giant stuff, and maybe about what it was like to fight back in the day. Just for the history, obviously. History? <laughs> Let's hope Tia's in a talkative mood after being in prison for so long. Not all of Odin's captives can be as charmingly voluble as myself. We have no proof Tyr is truly here. Right. That earthquake earlier. Do you think there will be another one? It's unlikely, but geological disturbances tend to be unpredictable. If the geysers and smell here are worse because of Fimble Winter. Maybe the earthquakes are too? Aye. You might be onto something, lad. Atreus, look ahead. Wow. Now this looks like a city. Welcome to neither of the brothers. Hey, dwarves! Oh. They're, uh, running away. I an alarm like that if I still had my body, and was fearing the notion of being detached from it. Why all that for us, though? They are scared. Was definitely an alarm, I'm afraid. Why is everybody hiding? Stay alert. Could we talk to we you don't for want any trouble, please? There'll be no help, to be sure. Best we find the tavern Sindri mentioned on our own. And hope they let us in. The buildings here really are incredible. The detail in the woodwork is quite extraordinary. <laughs> Is that a statue of Odin? They must really love him here. Or fear him. Hello. I'd return your surprise, but I did know you'd be here. I've got something for you. What is it, Dwarf? You know, I'm glad I came back here at least once before Ragnarok. Oh, if these cobblestones could talk. Then they'd have mouths. Filthy, disgusting mouths. Do you mind if I fiddle with your bow? Oof, you are long overdue for a replacement. <sighs> Taking advantage of certain material. Ow! Structural sensitivity to sonic vibrations has been something. Ah! I've been meaning to try for quite some time now. Thanks for, uh, finally trying it. What's it gonna be this time? Patience. I find it's best to see these things... Oh, in action. Ah. Whew. 
There. Oh, take aim at that gate there. But before you loose, say, Skialfa. Seems promising, though. For you. It should lead to the other side of the city. <laughs> open other doors around here. Another of Cavassia's poems. grip on this realm is so firm, any outsider is considered a threat. Sounds like an organism if I ever had one. 